Hello, hello, boys and girls. Happy Monday. Okay, so new lesson, chapter six, lesson four. And this week, we're going to talk about how Earth's uh, surface can change. So Earth has moving plates. So Earth's outer crust sits on top of another layer called the mantle. The crust and the mantle are divided into really big sections called plates that move all the time and they can cause really big changes in Earth's surface. The movement can cause natural disasters like earthquakes. And this is kind of what the plates look like. So you can see in this picture, all of the continents, there's North America, South America, Africa, Europe, Asia, Australia and Antarctica. And then if you look closer, you can see all these other outlines. And those outlines are the 12 major, what we call plate tectonics or tectonic plates that the crust and the mantle are made up of. And those are the plates that move, the tectonic plates that create natural disasters like earthquakes. So volcanoes. A volcano is a landform that forms an opening at Earth's surface where magma, which remember is hot melted rock, reaches the surface. Volcanoes have very different ways of exploding, and this is because of the different types of rock that make up magma. Sometimes pressure will build up so that the gases in magma explode. Hot rocks, gases, ash, and other particles burst from openings called vents. Sometimes magma oozes upward and flows from the volcanic opening. Lava, remember magma, once it reaches the surface, is then called lava. Lava and ash can spread over a very wide area and cover forests and cities. And an eruption can cause floods, landslides, and tsunamis, which are really big ocean waves. And there's a pretty cool picture of a volcano exploding. Alrighty, that is it for today. Make sure you are checking your folders for um, an assignment and I will be right back here tomorrow, same place for day two. Have a great day, guys.